hi guys and welcome back to our channel <laughs> anywho so a lot of people have been asking me what i do to grow my hair what products i use and so forth so i decided to make a video since i already took my braids out and i've had it for like two and a half months <laughs> anyways big up sheba if you guys need braids anything you don't want to tune to in the ear contact sheba sheba by the Anyways, so I took my hair out last night, my weave, my my braids, and this is my hair. It dirty, bad, 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 bad. I really want to show how in the look, <laughs> but it dirty, but anyways, this is my hair right now. So normally, so everybody would have said, oh, a salon she have in her ear, yes braids grow my hair and i rather to keep them in longer because yeah anywho i know i won't be able to sit down to comb it to braid it anymore so i wanted to keep it in as long as i could anywho so my braids are ours and everything and all right so normally i steam my hair before i wash it because i'm I had this hair in for so long just want to make sure i steam it out i don't know what y'all used to steam yours but i use jamaican black castor oil and trust me grow and repair so as long as it's jamaican castor oil see i don't know which one you guys use but i use this one, I got it, found it at TJ Maxx for like $4.50. It's called the Sunny Isle Extra Dark Authentic Jamaican Castor Oil. So, I'm going to rub it in. Distribute it all about. I normally do some smaller part, parts. I can make... I can't even talk, guys. I'm so... Sh I have bad shortness of breath. All right, so make it in smaller sections. <sighs> Distribute castor oil. This one here dirty. That's dirty bad. I'm just gonna do the same thing for all of it. I'm just making it in smaller parts so it's easier to distribute. All right. If you guys live in Jamaica, then you have the best castor oil because you know it was what I used to make it nata oil. <laughs> nata, put your nata in your matzo and make some. But I live in America, so I don't have that luxury. So I have to buy it at the store. And this one smells really authentic. So that's why I use it. Make sure you get them edges because you can't have sleek edges if you don't have any so i also i always make sure my edges are well distributed I'll twist it in a big twist. I, 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 I,
use this it's um the tresemme repair and protect instant recovery mask if you guys can see it i also use this sometimes i use the cocoa butter one the coconut cocoa coconut oil one by palmer's cocoa butter but today i'm using this one And this has biotin in it and everyone knows that biotin is good for your hair so i sometimes take the vitamins the biotin vitamins or the hair vitamins hair and skin all right so i'm just gonna redo this Ooh. and massage some of this Make sure you get the hands. All right. So this one is well distributed and twisted again. Oh, it smells so good. some disposable cherry caps on. And I'm gonna use two, but it's just me. To make sure it's well protected and sealed. So I don't have a I don't have a blow dryer at home. The ones that you sit under. So I'm just gonna go do my chores and I sweat easily so that should be enough to distribute it all about but if you live in a tropical climate place you can go outside you can go for a run in the sun you can go sit in the sun or whatever to get it to sweat but where I am at where I live is really cold right now so I'm just gonna do some household chores and I'll be back. Oh, and I'm gonna leave it for 15 minutes or 20 minutes and then I'll be back. <laughs> Bye, see you in a minute. Okay guys, I'm back. So this has been sweating for about 20 minutes now and it's time to wash it. Okay, so you can see it's well distributed. And so now I'm gonna wash it. Told you I have curly hair.
iron. So I'm gonna wash it out and then I'm gonna shampoo and conditioner it. I don't know what shampoo which shampoo you guys use, but I use um Pantene, I use Tresemme, I use Garnier Futis. I don't have a really special one to use. I've used any one that I've used in my hair and it works. That's the one I use. So today I'm using Tresemme Repair and Protect with Biotin in it. See that? Biotin. That's the best thing to look for in your conditioner and your shampoo. So now I'm going to wash it out real quick. Shampoo and conditioner. And I'm just going to do some Bantu nuts in it. Um, if you're from Jamaica, you call it Chani Bump. Here we call it Bantu nuts. All right. So I'll be back again. Okay, guys, I'm back. So, I conditioner and shampooed my hair. And now, I'm just going to spray some leave-in leave -in conditioner in it. I don't know. I use the Oregon Oil um, Strength and Shine leave-in conditioner. This is the one I've always used. And sometimes I use the Black Jamaican Plaster Oil leave-in one by Shea Moisture. So I just sprayed, distributed it all about. And the good thing about it, it has a pump on it, so you can just spray, 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 spray. I blood dried some of the water out already, so. make sure you shake it first i had shake it before i started the video but just make sure you shake it first if you have this one all right curls it's the winter time now so i can't leave my hair i can't do a cold wash and go or wash and go because it's too cold it will freeze so i gotta put in a protective style all right so i use contour as well because you know if you want your hair to grow you gotta keep it moisturized growing up i always hear like your hair should be always dry because it will break your hair off if it's wet. No, it's the opposite. No, nothing like that. You have to keep it moisturized. Make sure you massage it onto your scalp. And get the edges. <laughs> and the back too. Alright. I have a doctor's appointment so I have to, I can't twist it now because i have to go in 30 minutes so i'm just gonna put it in a ponytail and then when i come back i'll do the, the twist in it all right and then you always have to use a, a grease to seal it so i use coconut oil that's what i've always used it doesn't have to be a brand name. I just got this one at CVS Pharmacy. It's um organic coconut oil. That's it. It doesn't it, it can be used to cook, it can be used to do whatever. Just make sure it's not the one that they add preservative and salt to. This is just a regular one. 
and I'm just using it to seal my contouring. And that's the one I use for my hair oil. Normally, I would just make it in smaller parts and do it, but today I don't have time. So, yep. This is what I do to my hair all the time. I'm just washing my brush out so every time I wash my hair I wash my brush <laughs> because I can't have clean hair and dirty brush all right so I'm just gonna put my ponytail like I said I have to go so excuse me brush the front out I want it to be too tight because I always have headaches. So this is how I'm going to wait to the doctors. It's going to be dry and like, it will be dry, but if not, I'll just blow dry it with my regular blow dryer for a few minutes. And then when I come back, I'll do some twisting it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.